How to replace a Pentair Whisperflow pump motor. Turn off power to the pump at the breaker. Remove six seal plate bolts using a 9 16th socket wrench. Slide the motor assembly back and away from the pump housing. Locate and disconnect the copper binding wire from the motor. Remove the wiring cover plate or motor end cap from the back of the motor. Disconnect all hot, ground, and neutral wires. Pull the disconnected wires out of the motor. The motor should now be completely detached and free to move. Remove the conduit adapter if present and set aside for reuse on the replacement motor. Remove the two diffuser screws with an Allen wrench. Pull away the diffuser from the seal plate and set aside for reuse on the replacement motor. If an impeller lock screw is present on the inside of the impeller, it will need to be removed. First, stabilize the back of the motor shaft with a flathead screwdriver or a half-inch wrench. While the motor shaft is stabilized, unscrew the impeller lock screw. Continue to stabilize the motor shaft and unscrew the impeller. Set the impeller aside for reuse on the replacement motor. Unscrew the remaining four bolts and separate the motor from the seal plate. The old motor is now completely disassembled and can be discarded. You must now remove the old shaft seal from the seal plate and the impeller. Flip the seal plate over and use a flathead screwdriver to push out the old shaft seal. Continue to pry out the other half of the shaft seal from the impeller. Both halves of the old shaft seal can now be discarded. Acquire the new shaft seal and apply RTV silicone to the shaft seal's seal plate side. Place the shaft seal half into the seal plate and use a 1 inch PVC coupler to lightly hammer it into place. Make certain that the shaft seal is completely seated in the seal plate. Take the other half of the new shaft seal and place it into the impeller with the white portion facing up. Use a clean towel to press down on the seal and completely seat it into the impeller. It's now time to reassemble the seal plate assembly onto the new replacement motor. Slide the seal plate onto the new motor. Ensure that it is oriented in the correct position with the bottom markings placed at the bottom of the motor. Reinstall the four bolts that secure the seal plate to the motor. Remove the end cap from the new motor. 
Stabilize the motor shaft with a half inch wrench and reinstall the impeller by rotating clockwise. Continue screwing until the wrench starts to turn with the impeller. If you previously removed an impeller lock screw, you can reinstall it at this time while stabilizing the motor shaft. Reinstall the diffuser by fastening the two Allen screws to the seal plate. Remove the old diffuser o-ring and housing gasket, then discard. Remove the wiring plug from the back of the motor and reinstall the conduit adapter. Run the previously removed wires back into the new motor and reconnect according to the wiring diagram found on the motor label. Reinstall the end cap onto the motor. Reattach the copper bonding wire onto the motor bonding lug. Replace the diffuser o-ring and housing gasket. Slide the motor assembly into the pump housing and reinstall all six bolts. You have successfully replaced your Pintair WhisperFlow motor. If you have any additional questions, leave a comment down below or visit us over at inyopools.com for all your swimming pool and spa needs.